All right, and we're back. Um, well, don't really know what else I need to do. So let's just let's just head this direction, shall we? Is it not giving me? Oh, wait. oh, wait. oh, yeah. I guess you can't autopilot into the sun if you're targeting the sun. <laughs> it's actually kind of interesting that they made that a thing when autopilot generally brings you to the sun even if you're aiming for something else. Alright, so. I'm going straight to old... It's old spacey. That's what Gabbro called it. Old spacey. And then we'll be able to find the construct again. Uh, go. Hold up a sec. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard you know about the launch codes. What? No, I was going to tell you about using the ship log to set destination markers for locations you visited before. It's a brilliant feature, if I say so myself. Dead useful. And the risk it poses of shorting out fuel regulator and causing the ship to explode is so minimal that only Gossen would worry about it. How... what about locations I haven't visited before? Wait, wait, so how do I use it? It's weird, because this is information I already know. But he's never stopped me and asked, told me about this before, so... Yeah, this is all new dialogue to me. This was extraordinarily convenient timing, thanks. That's not what my voice sounds like. <laughs> Everyone's a critic. Anyway, I've got a fire into a joy, and you've got launch codes to grab, so go wild with the marking feature while you're out there. Just uh, try not to follow it so directly you fly into the sun, all right? Okay, so. He's never, yeah, he's never stopped me to say that before. So I am kind of wondering if maybe the devs just realized people weren't using that feature as much as they should have, and they were like, "Okay, well, let's have let's have Slate tell you to do that." Radio tower, ocean depths, statue island, the stranger. Okay, will that take us straight? That was my other thought. Can we go straight there? Uh, okay. We got it marked. Yeah, we can go straight there. I wonder if that means you could also crash into it by accident. Okay, so we don't have to go to old spacey every time. I didn't consider that to be a possibility. I thought it was like a perspective type thing. I'm just gonna take this hat off. There we go. We're going hatless. Hmm. Yeah. Whoa. Okay. We move away from it. Yeah, it disappears again. We move towards it. Interesting. Okay, we can see the sun. We can't see anything else, though. That's interesting. Let's try... Searching around here a little bit more. What happens if I get to the other side? Whoa! No, I don't want to get too far away. Yeah, gravity behaves weirdly, because it feels like it's, like... If you're at a certain distance away, it feels like it's pushing you away. Oof. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. Wow, okay, I gotta work on my docking procedure here, I guess. Wait, pre-flight checklist. Oh, interesting. This gives you another way to get that menu right away. Yeah, those are all. Jetpack boost can be triggered with a separate button. Press. Yeah, I feel like I'd rather do that. That might be the sort of control that they added because people were complaining. Or people didn't totally understand how to use the other the jetpack normally. Error unknown language. It is a timing thing. There we go. Because the first time I did that, it didn't seem like I did it perfectly. Rotate. Drop. Okay, I can't easily get up there. Alright. Hmm. Can I avoid that light and just keep on going? Yes, I totally can. see more if I just travel along the river and end up at the end up at the dam before it breaks perhaps. Get away from those rocks. If I hit the rocks too hard I don't know if that'll smash up my ramp or, or my raft or none. There's structures I haven't explored yet. I was just starting to explore them when I ran out of time. I like the music in this. These look like rapids. I wonder what the point of those ropes are. Man. Okay, no, we're not at the dam yet. We're getting close, though. Whoa. That was weird. Who's making that noise? Okay, now we're at... The reservoir, I guess you would call it. I'm probably gonna keep making up names until the ship logs the ship's log tells me the actual name of what I'm looking at. Let's go over here. This used to be another structure. So there probably used to be a lot more buildings here. It's kind of a wonder that these wooden structures lasted as long as they did, really. Faces. Oh, and we can actually pick up this lantern now. Oh, here we go. Insert lantern. So we gotta find another film reel, I think. Is it a tree? Tree under the stars. But I don't think you can see stars here. Man, I love these paintings because they're so creepy looking, but 
not really, like, ugly or threatening. There we go. No, no film reels. The way the doors work kind of incentivizes you to turn off your flashlight, which is good to keep in mind. Because that means sometimes you'll probably be turning off your flashlight and not turning it back on when the game would want you to. Okay, there's no- oh, there's a door here. No, yeah, there's no film reel. Must be in a different structure. Is gravity lower as you go closer to the middle? I think it is. I was trying to think of if that makes sense for centripetal forces, but it seems like it does. Okay, we've, this is the room we've already been in. No film reel. It's probably in an entirely different area altogether. <clears throat> and I have to come over here with a ramp. It could also be the sort of thing where it's like there's a couple of different film reels in different locations, and it doesn't matter which one you take to where. What is this? This seems important. This is some type of code. Okay, I'm gonna have to figure out that code. Hmm. Wait, so... There is a diamond star, there's a sun, there's a ringed planet, there's a waning moon, there's a half moon, there's a crescent moon, there is fire. Don't know what that symbol is supposed to be. I didn't get it right on the first try. Well, I'm giving up. Garbage game. Zero out of ten. Would not buy again. Okay. What are we looking at in here? Uh, can I even fit through here? Wait. Leading into the area that I was just trying to. Oh, hey! Okay, sun, mask, fire, mask, fire. Cool. Well, that was random, but hey. I didn't expect it. Okay. Sun. Mask. I don't know if it's supposed to be a mask or not. Fire. Mask. Fire. There we go. Okay. Okay, so this... These controls are busted. Oh, there goes the dam. Something else broke over there. Oh, this broke. This dock. <laughs> you can see the water. The, the tidal. Water tide. Or whatever you call it. Oh, 
what is the word I'm looking for? The water wave, the big wave. You can see the big wave going. Yeah, it's still going around. What happens when it gets back here? Does it like rush through? Oh, a little bit. It's kind of simmered down a little bit there. Well, there are places to explore here. There's a lot to explore in this place. Like, the location density of this new... I guess it's fair to call this a new world. Well, new to us, anyway. So what is with this giant bell thing? like a giant bell, but that's probably not what it is. One big difference between these guys and the Nomai is the Nomai left skeletons, whereas I haven't found I haven't found any remains of this civilization at all. From these peoples. We don't even know if they died or not. They could have just left. here is a pain, though. Be sweet if you could bring your ship right in here. Ooh. Am I stuck? Okay, no. I thought I was stuck there for a second. to time it right so you get a good a good boost but I'm making do Ooh, oh that's better okay this is probably not the way you're supposed to go up here but heck, I'm exploring what's in here Okay, we're at... What is this even supposed to be? Do I have to put a lamp there? Oh, okay, so you can go inside of it. Except there was a big- it was sitting on top of a big rock. Is that rock still there? Maybe the rock's not there if I get here early enough. I don't even know what this is, but it looks like it must be important. <laughs> have weird little wands, similar to the Nomai's as well. Oh, I was gonna try to jump over there and grab that lantern. Yeah, so is this still sitting on top of a big rock? No, it's not. I can't tell if this is made of wood or not. It doesn't look like it is. It looks like, well, it could be metal, or it could be wood. Part wood, part metal. Is this just like a big counterweight or something, maybe? Yeah, I thought it was resting on top of a rock, but I guess it must not be. Okay, there is a green fire. It's 
so... These look like a sound waves or something like that. That's what- maybe that's what they're supposed to represent. It rem reminds me of those, um... Physics experiments where you like... When they were trying to figure out quantum mechanics and they were seeing how... Light, um... Photons were... Being scattered in... What was it called? It was like the gold foil... The slip, um... Yeah, slip pattern experiment or something like that? I don't know. <laughs> Seriously? Fuck, why not? Is it cooking? Yeah, it's cooking. Nice. Uh, I can't, okay, it just burns like regular fire. fire. If I eat this, will I get cancer? Like super cancer or something? No. Doesn't look like it. So what is this? Is it different to be here if I get here before the dam breaks? Burns, like, burns me like a regular fire. Doesn't give me super cancer. Oh, we're running out of time anyway. we went to after the dam burst in the first loop we were here. Hmm. Okay, well, I'll be right back. Just need to take a quick washroom break. So we'll just leave this running here. Watch the sun below us.
Alright. I didn't miss too much time. For some reason I saw those tree roots and I thought they were like those antler owls. Well, we definitely want to take a look at our ship's log. Because I saw some stuff I didn't totally understand, but maybe my ship's log will tell me how to interpret it. I never actually read the descriptions for any of the other stuff either, so we'll take a moment to look through all that. Radio tower. A radio tower designed to receive photos taken by the deep space satellite. There are several photos of the entire solar system hanging on the walls. Hornfills noticed something strange in one of the photos, but concluded the equipment malfunction was the only sensible explanation. A massive artificial ring world hidden within some sort of cloaking field. It does not appear to be Hearthian or Nomayan in origin. Where should we start here? We'll, we'll start here. R river lowlands. A low-lying region near the entrance to the stranger. There are wooden buildings along the banks of the river. There's more to explore here. A reservoir. An enormous reservoir with wooden piers and buildings on both shores. There's more to explore here. Submerged structure. A large metal structure suspended by chains. It can be entered by swimming from below. There is a sealed vault illuminated by a green fire inside the structure. I found a strange vault wrapped in chains and marked with three glowing symbols. Yeah. Hmm. A pair of small rocky islands connected by a village of still houses. Okay, that's where the tower, that weird tower thing was. The Cinder Isles. So the sealed vault, I'm presuming we can get into at some point. And there's probably other locations that we haven't visited yet. Yeah. A stranger. Oh, it just shows up on the map now. Well, that's handy. Except it would help. There you go. Yeah, if I noticed that the first after my first visit there, then that would have been handy. Okay, so I think what we'll do is we'll finish exploring the river lowlands. It probably has some secrets we won't be able to find an answer to until after we've explored other areas. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on. Whoa, 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 too fast. Overcompensating. Oh. ship is going to be all kinds of fucked up by the end of this. Alright. Hey, what's that? I didn't notice that before. Oh, it's just some random boxes. Nothing of import. Why does gravity seem to be reversed here? Wait, what direction is gravity going in? Okay, it's not reversed, it's just... Ooh. Okay, that's toward the center. Okay, so that makes sense. That's still the way centripetal force should be working according to the rules of this game. Ow! Let's heal up. I hate to waste time, but who knows if we could just come within a, an, an inch of our life. Wait, what? 
This is a different entrance than I took before. We're in... oh no, we're right at the beginning of the... rest of the lowlands. Okay, well let's do a little exploring before the dam bursts then. I wonder if we can control where we go in based on how long we shine our light on that door. I wonder... Well, we're here now. Let's give this room a look-see. Okay, so that's just a ramp. Or, a raft, rather. Whoa! Okay, this is an exit. Oh! This is where I've come out previous times. Okay. That makes sense. I just didn't notice there was a door there, that's all. Did I come out on the other side? Well... There's probably no sense in trying to swim through that vent, since that's where all the water is rushing out of. Let's get a good look at this dam. It seems to have a design on it. It looks like a face, almost. Like one of those owl faces. I don't think it's supposed to be significant to us, though. Is there anything we can scan for you in here? haven't looked upstairs yet either. Um. Oh yeah. Okay, we can't get the whole picture when it's like that. We're gonna need a proper lantern. Like the lanterns we were finding before. So it doesn't seem like. Ooh. There's more slide reels. Oh, wait. That has. Okay, that has the same pattern that was at the top of the structure in the reservoir. have the same thing? Okay, no, it has... It has a ringed planet. like a door closing. Then you see two eyes very faintly at the top. Like, well, as close to the top as you can see. Yeah. Okay, it's coming closer. Then it switches. Okay, we need it. To 
to be able to see that properly, I think we need an, a lantern. Like a better, better lantern than my scout. And one of their normal, one of their green lanterns. I'm also running out of fuel, which is troublesome. What's in here? Oh yeah. Oh, these... Oh, okay, so they are lit. It was after the damn burst that I found them the first time, so maybe they just aren't lit when the water washes through them. Okay, so that looks a lot better. This is probably going to be more usable. All right, so yeah, those are the two. Those are the three patterns on the the water structure that I was calling the bell. It's making noise too. themselves around. Okay, so this bit implies to me that something happened to the film and it got ruined. So there is information that used to be there, but we are missing it now. I'm not entirely sure what any of that means, though. Other than... Well, the ship log will help shed some light on that for me. Let us... Oh. Put in the next reel before the dam breaks. Okay. That looks like the eye of the universe on the right. Is this their home planet? The one with the rings? Yeah, that's our solar system and the eye of the universe. Okay. They were attracted by the eye signal, just like the Nomai were. And that must be their home planet. Freaky mouths. Missing information. What is that? Oh, it's showing them building the stranger. So they must live on the moon of that ringed planet. I think that's what that implies. Okay, so... They built the stranger and brought it over here. See, yeah, his <laughs> freaky mouth. I was not expecting them to have a mouth like that. Their mouth is just like a black void that they hide under their feathers. Zoom the stranger over and park it. And I'm assuming they don't know where the eye of the universe is either. They're looking for it, just like the Nomai were. That's an assumption. I could be proven wrong. Okay, the dam hasn't burst yet. I was a little bit worried that the dam would burst while I was looking at those. You can see it's starting to... It's getting there. 
it is not in good shape now. Well, let's see if we can get to that tower. Ooh. Damn it. I lost the ability to boost. Let's get down the river a little bit further before the dam bursts. Ouch. Ooh. Oh. Going down the river like this is dangerous for your health. Can I get up here? Now I've lost the ability to boost. I don't know if I'll be able to get up in there now. Can I find a fuel canister? Oh, did the dam burst already? Nope, not yet. Ooh. Nope, cannot do that. God damn it. Okay, I have to... How do I get up there? I'm like panicking because I'm not sure if I have enough time. There we go. I was barking up the wrong tree, going the wrong direction to get up here. Yeah, they have their own eye shrine. Yeah, excellent. Yeah. Starting to get the feeling I will not learn this alien's new language with how much effort they put into, like, just visual videos. Oh, okay. He's playing, playing a music, musical instrument. Like a lute or a violin or a cello. in here. Oh, hey. That'll be useful. Okay, this is the same as the other tower, isn't it? Is there anything behind it? Does not appear so. This might be a path that leads somewhere, but let's finish exploring here first. Seems like every one of those paintings is unique. Oh, there's more. Oh, already holding lantern. Okay, I need to find projector. Nice, perfect. Good timing. We are running out of time. Insert lantern. That dam is probably. Oh, there it goes. How much of this can I read through before the tower falls over? There's the Eye of the Universe. I'm trying to just kind of like absorb this as quickly as possible without just skipping through. Did they scan the Eye of the Universe? The Eye of the Universe turned red. The Eye of the Universe did something. The Eye of the Universe was going to kill them. And grass would grow on their corpses. Oh wow, that's even freakier than before. <laughs> Is this them deciding that the Eye of the Universe might be evil? Well, we don't think the Eye of the Universe is evil. Oh. Oh. Well, for whatever reason, they decided it was... 
was evil. into cloaking mode. Okay, I got to quit out of that. Because I feel like this tower is about to fall. Oh, there it goes. Yeah. There's another reel in here I didn't get to see. I'm pretty sure it was these shelves that I saw in the game's trailer. And I saw a reel sitting on the shelves, and I thought it was a little scout. to continue exploring that later. Let's not... I mean... There's these giant cliffs here that you can't get up to directly. You probably have to travel all the way on to the other side and then go back backtrack. What is that sound? Oh, it's... Fuck. Yeah. I was wondering what those ropes were last time I passed under them. Now that the water rose above them, I realized, oh, they're electrical cables, not ropes. That is what happened in my head, just as I was asking the question and as I was going over top of them. It was a good surprise, though. Alright, so... For a second, I thought that was like a note I could read. I was gonna say, hey, that wasn't there before. Alright, ship log time. Burned slide reel. Slide reel that shows the origin of the stranger and its inhabitants. Several slides have been burned and cannot be viewed. Slide reel that shows the stranger's inhabitants analyzing an anomaly that closely resembles the Nomai symbol for the Eye of the Universe. Several slides have been burned and cannot be viewed. Cinder Isles. So Maybe that's why they call it the Cinder Isles, because that's where their eye shrine was before they burned it down. A pair of small rocky islands connected by a village of still houses. I found a large metal symbol inside a burned out building that closely resembles the Nomai symbol for the eye of the universe. There's more to explore there. There's more to explore there, too. Sealed vault. There's more to explore there. Is that still... yeah, no, it's still marked. Which is good. I don't think... I don't think the mark persisted between loops before. But, I mean... It's good that they made that change for this DLC. Because you're gonna go back there off and on. against me. Ooh. I imagine depending on your approach, you could crash into it. Ooh. I'm just accepting the fact that there's no, not going to be a smooth way to land in here. Next time I'll have to remember to not unbuckle before I'm fully stopped. So that could have bounced me around and did some damage. 
wait. Okay, yeah, so there is definitely different entrances because I walked up at one point to get in here. Let's test out my theory. Okay, there's the dam. So I'm on this side. Okay, there's an- oh, so- so that doesn't move you around. I was wondering if maybe it did. So far, these are the only two entrances I've found. They're both at the- near the dam. Whoa, 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 what is that? Fire. Okay, here we go. Ghost matter. This is what I was trying to find out more about. Hmm. So either they died before the ghost matter. Ooh. Or they died because of the ghost matter. Is there a hole in the roof? Oh. Dang it. I tried. I slipped off the roof and landed in the ghost matter. I think that's what happened. Either that or the ghost matter extended past the roof. Take another short break, but I will be right back in about two minutes.